Hi, this is Peter from the DJ Podcast. In this video tutorial, we'll be looking at the two sync modes in Native Instruments Tractor Pro 2. The sync function in Tractor Pro 2 makes it easy to automatically beat match multiple tracks together. By default, the track's tempo and phase will align when you press the sync button. However, you can change how Tractor Pro 2 syncs tracks by switching the sync mode. Start by opening up the preferences by clicking on the cogwheel icon up in the top right. Then, go down to the Transport tab. You can see under Sync Mode that Beat Sync is currently selected, but we also have the option of using Tempo Sync. Beat Sync is the mode that you're probably familiar with if you've used Tractor Pro 2 before. In Beat Sync Mode, both the phase and tempo of a track are aligned when the Sync button is pressed. You'll notice that you can only bend the pitch of the track that is set as the master, and this will ensure that the tracks you've synced together never go out of phase. Let's take a look at an example of how Beat Sync works. If I play the track on the left, it'll automatically be set to the master. If I then go and press the sync button on the track on the right, you'll see that it speeds up its BPM to match the one on the left, and that the pitch bend buttons are disabled on the right track deck. If I want to pitch bend both of the tracks at the same time, I have to do them from the track deck on the left. If I switch from Beat Sync to Tempo Sync, Pressing the sync button will still align both the phase and tempo of the tracks. However, unlike beat sync, tempo sync does not prevent you from pitch bending the track decks that are synced to the master. When you bend the pitch of a synced track, the BPM will remain synced while you adjust the phase. Let me show you an example. So once again, I have two tracks that are loaded in my track decks that are at different BPMs. So I'm going to press play on the track deck on the left, and it will automatically set itself to be the master. Then I'm going to press the sync button on the right track deck and you'll see that it speeds up to match the BPM of the track deck on the left. So I'm going to press play and you'll see that the two tracks are both in time with each other with the phasing and the tempo. Because we're in tempo sync mode, I can pitch bend this track either up or down and you'll see that the phase meter will adjust depending on how out of phase you are. If I want to bring the track back into phase, I can simply click the sync button to disable sync, and then press on the sync button again to bring the two tracks back into phase. Thanks for watching this Tractor Pro 2 video tutorial. To learn more about Tractor Pro 2, visit thedjpodcast.com.